Hello. Yes guys, in this video I will show you how to correctly draw buildings. Buildings are a little bit different when it comes to drawing because they are mostly made up of straight lines. If you draw without any rules or care, it is possible to draw whatever you want and make it look as good as possible. But when it comes to buildings, uh, it's very easy to lose the sense of its geometry. But things are going to look a little bit off if you are not careful with your perspective and the comparative scale of different parts of the drawing. If you are not careful, your drawing may end up looking something like this. It is important to make things appear geometrically correct. They don't have to be the most accurate, but the key is to make what you want uh, look believable and three-dimensional. For that I always start with perspective lines. It's a good guideline to help you make the building look like what it will actually look like if you were standing in front of it. You don't have to go into too much detail here. Just know where your vanishing points will generally be and these major lines are gonna determine some of the major geometry of your drawing. After that you can sort of guess the rest of the lines and fill in the rest of the geometry based on that. As always, don't start shading just yet because geometry is more important at this stage so start drawing at your own pace and with your own style. For the supporting parts of the drawing like vegetation and whatnot, you don't have to draw every single leaf or rock that you see in the scene. Just make it look like it's there. So there are so many different ways to shade this and give a three dimensional appearance to your drawing. When I shade I always start from the darkest areas of the drawing and then I move on to the lighter ones. And then I blend them together so that there is a decent gradient from light to dark. So something that I've also learned working on this YouTube channel and drawing throughout the years is that at some point you just have to let your instincts take over and uh, you have to stop micromanaging everything that you're doing with your pen and pencil. The idea is to learn how to draw and have fun doing it. It's not about executing a perfect picture. You have to let your own style shine in the way that you draw. Let yourself go a little bit and let your sensibilities handle the drawing itself. To make any drawing appear believable, you have to give it some sense of depth, so things that are closer to you should appear closer and things that are supposed to be farther should appear as such. And that's how you draw buildings. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and see you in the next one.